everyone, welcome back to Alleyways, or if it's your first time here, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video, and if you haven't already, please, please, please make sure to join the Alleyways family. Subscribe to my channel, give this video a big thumbs up, and turn on post notifications, not only so you know when I have new content, but also so I can include you in my subscriber shout out. I am beyond grateful for each and every one of you, and my subscriber shout out is just my small way of thanking and acknowledging you. I will be shouting out a very special subscriber at the end of today's video, so make sure you stay tuned until the end in case that's you. All right, we are back today on my channel with another trendy Amazon haul from my favorite ever Amazon store, Malumia. They have amazing pieces, great prices, quick shipping, and it's become really my go-to place to shop for events, a vacation, and every day. Let's go try some stuff on. Okay, so we're gonna go through some tops first. Just ignore my pants, we'll get to them in a little bit. But I'm obsessed with this little top. So it, as you can see, this is like a lime celery green kind of little silk blouse. It has adjustable straps and some really nice little ruching, a little frill detail. It's cropped, it's light, uh, it feels really great on in person, good quality. It does have adjustable straps that if you wanted a strapless look, let me just make sure we keep this a family channel. There we go. If you wanted a strapless look, you could take it down to strapless just by tucking that in. I love this. I think it's a versatile piece. You could dress it up or down. You could even use it as a cover up if you wanted. Loved it so much. I got it in two other colors and there's even more options than that. So don't be surprised if I did before, but let's go try on the other colors. And then I want you guys to vote for which is your favorite in the comments down below. Okay, I might like this one more. I also got it in chocolate brown. Brown has come back in a big way. I mean, at least I think so. You guys let me know if you agree. I've been seeing brown everywhere again, and I just thought this color looked really beautiful. And I'm so glad I also got this top in brown. I can't wait to style it with jeans or different skirts, um, or maybe even some cute shorts. This does fit true to size and it's comfortable and you just need to wear a strapless bra with it. Let me know how you would style it. I think like with some wide leg high waisted trousers, it could be really beautiful and elegant. Making a mental note of that. Okay, and here, last but certainly not least, of course had to get black. Black is my favorite color to wear. It's my go-to when I'm styling. Um, universally flattering, I think we all like black. With all of these, you don't have to worry about any kind of level of sheerness. They're totally opaque, soft, comfy. I'll show you guys these pants in a minute, but I even like it with just these kind of like pants. It'd be cool with these pants and maybe like a blazer over it. But just a great top all around for a really good price. I love it. Okay, let's try on what's next. I am a sucker for anything with an oversized bow. Always have been, always will be. So when I saw this, of course I immediately had to get it. I love this dramatic one sleeve oversized bow look. Love the sherbety orange color. Uh, fits true to size, is opaque. It's not li uh, lined or padded. So you will have to have specialty undergarments, just a strapless bra. Uh, it feels really comfortable. It's just a kind of a nylon blend for the fabric. I ordered this for vacation, but I couldn't find something that I felt like was just perfect with it to go for pants or a skirt. I think it'd be really cute to do a color blocking look, maybe with something hot pink. What do you guys think? I also just want to point out, I have it tucked in to give it kind of a high waisted look, but if you're not into that, there is plenty of length. So it's not a crop top. I know a lot of people are tired of everything being crop tops. It does hit right at your hips. Um, I just love this. I think it is absolutely gorgeous, so elegant. And again, you could dress it up or down. You could put it with denim shorts or something like a maxi skirt. Oh, I can't wait to style this. Next up, we have this black blouse. Now, I got this in white last year from Malumia and I love this blouse. I wear it all the time and I feel like every time I wear it, I get compliments. Um, it's, I don't know, it's just a great blouse. So I'll come up close so y'all can see there's some smocking detail underneath the bust that then leads to almost like a little peplum ruffle. It has this kind of puff shoulder and then smocking and puff and then a frill detail around the wrist. Just so much detail that makes it look really expensive 
and really well tailored. It does have a little button in the back to clasp and it's not cropped. Again, it hits right around the hips. I am somebody who has to wear blouses for work a lot, so I'm always trying to find great basic blouses with a little flair just to make myself feel more dressed up. And this will go with so many things. I'm actually gonna move the camera back so you can see it with these pants. I would totally wear this as an outfit. I'm actually gonna start up close on these pants so you all can see the color. So it's a mixture of like tan, a darker beige, black and white. It's a really great classic plaid pattern with really nice angle pockets and a black plastic uh, button closure and black metal zip. It does not have pockets in the back but they are high-waisted, so they come up over my belly button, and I'm 5'6". Now I'm going to back up so you can see full length, and then we'll talk about uh, the material and styling and everything. Okay, so here is a wider look at our pants. As you can see, they are high-waisted, but they hit right at my ankles, and this rarely happens for me. I'm 5'6", which I realize is not short, uh, but I also don't feel tall, and I feel like so many pants these days are made so long that it makes me feel like I am not wearing the right size clothes. Uh, but these hit right at the ankle, they're perfect, they're actually a wool kind of material, and then look at these cute little side pockets here. You guys know I'm a sucker for pockets. They just feel so cool. I don't know how else to describe them other than just to say but they're cool, they're trendy. You could really dress them up and make them look elegant. You could dress them down and make them look more street style. I think it would look great with this blouse and a pair of Doc Martens in the fall. Um, they aren't like technically real wool, they're a little bit thinner, so if you wanted to style them with like a little crop tank for summer and white tennis shoes like I do now, it'd be an awesome outfit. But I love to get a piece like this. It gets me excited to try new things with my clothes. So, how would you style these pants? Let me know. Okay, fam, I'm super bummed. Okay, I ordered this leather skirt. So it's actually kind of like a croc leather. Obviously, it is a faux leather. It is not real. Um, I thought this was so, so cute online. I loved the notch detail. I loved that it had a functional zipper, which I didn't unzip all the way in the back. I thought this is so cute and would be great as we look forward to fall, but it doesn't fit true to size. So, I ordered a medium and I could take in about, I don't know, what do you think, mom? Two inches? Yeah. Yeah, about two inches on the waist. Um, Cause it's meant to be a high-waisted skirt. They do have this in other colors, but this is why we do clothing hauls. If you love this style, so look how cute it would be if it fit. Ah, oh, wouldn't that be cute? If you love this style, just make sure to check the sizing chart and then even size down so it fits correctly. But I still love it and maybe I'll see either if I can return it or take it in. I'll keep you guys updated. They also do have this in black and I believe green. Don't quote me on that, but you can look for yourself. I'll have links to all this in the description box down below. Um, so yeah. Okay fam, now we're moving in to swimsuits from Malumia. I got so many and I took them on vacation with me um, and wore them. They wear well, they were really high quality. When they got wet, they did not get see-through. So that just goes for all of these that I'm about to show you. Starting with this one. So this is a bandeau with micro ribbing. It comes in this really cool kind of blue green color. It has these cinch ties on each side of the bandeau. It is fully lined and padded. And then it comes with these super cheeky, I'm gonna do a quick turn because I'm a little bit embarrassed, but super cheeky bottoms uh, that you can pull up high on the sides that also have ruching here. It is so buttery soft and comfortable. I actually wore this snorkeling one morning down uh, in Turks and Caicos and didn't have any trouble being super active and swimming in it, which is really impressive for a bando. I personally love this suit. Okay, this might actually be my favorite swimsuit I got from Malumia. It is this really sweet, light blue bikini. So I'm gonna come up close so y'all can see it has this micro ribbing, but the ribbing actually is like a squiggle, which I think is a really cool detail. It has really, really baby soft fabric that's almost a little bit fuzzy. It's fully lined and padded, and then it has this little detail here where you take these strings that are attached and you just crisscross them in the front or, you know, tie them 
however you want. Mom, does this have adjustable straps? Mm -hmm. Okay, the adjustable straps, fully lined bottoms. You guys can see it's pretty cheeky. So for our bum coverage crew, this might not be the one for you, but it's not too bad. Um, I love this. Was super comfortable in it all day. Did water sports and never had a problem. I think the style is so cute and the fabric is nice and just different from anything else I have. Okay, so as we talked about, brown is back in a big way. It is absolutely everywhere and there are so many brown swimsuits this summer. I saw this one and thought it was so cute. So as you can see, it's a tie halter, so you can tie this up to get a super custom fit. And then this is actually a loose tie in the middle. So if you wanted to wear this as just a bandeau like that, you could, or you just take this and loop it through and you can just like leave them, you know, Kind of hanging in a knot or tied up in a bow it's really up to you i always like to have little kind of customizable pieces like that because then you can style them different ways and it looks like you're wearing a different swimsuit the top is fully lined and padded the bottom is lined on the front and the back is like very much nearing uh thong level i really like the top of the swimsuit though because it's like that thick kind of back so you feel like you've got a lot of support and then I love this swimsuit overall trendy comfy cute uh, a little bit saucy but my biggest disappointment was the cover-up you guys I love this swimsuit and would buy it just for the swimsuit alone but I'm gonna step into this the cover-up online looked so cute and then it's just not it on me it's like a, it's supposed to be a mesh skirt and I don't know if I need to size down or what, or maybe you guys like this and I, it's just me, but I just thought it looked a little cuter online. I, not that I need another cover up. I could put any other cover up with this. Um, it just like didn't meet. It wasn't, it didn't look as good on me as it did on the model. But now that I'm seeing it on camera, it's kind of cute. Maybe I'm tripping here. Okay, so this swimsuit is the same exact material and color as our first swimsuit. It's just a different style. Um, fully lined and padded on both top and bottom. But the bottom has zero bum coverage, so I'm just going to leave that to your imagination. But the top is really cool. So you can see it has these cool little cutout kind of details and it's one shouldered and super dramatic and fun and crazy. It doesn't have any adjustable pieces, so I wouldn't have to worry about things popping open or slipping and sliding or sagging. Uh, it feels really nice and fitted. So again, I think I can be really active in this. This one, I did not wear doing anything active on vacation, but I still think it's just cute and different. What do you guys think? I wanna know which of these swimsuits is your favorite. Okay, so our last three swimsuits are all one pieces. I love having one pieces on vacation in case I get to the end of vacation and I've got sunburns and need coverage or a lot of times when I'm traveling, I just feel bloated. Let's be honest. And I like to have something that just offers a little bit more coverage. I saw this one on their website and absolutely loved it. I loved like the black and white tie dye. But my favorite part was the back. I love this crisscross detail and you can cinch this to help really get a custom fit. And then without looking too closely, there is some cinching on the booty that just makes it look a little bit sassy, if you will. I really like that it's cut up high on the thighs, but still gives plenty of bum coverage. I just think this is cute and different. And honestly, every time I get a one piece swimsuit, I'm like, I could get away with wearing this as a bodysuit. And I think this would be really cute as a bodysuit with a pair of black pants or shorts or something. So don't be surprised if you see me do it. Okay. This might be my favorite. How beautiful is this swimsuit? It is a one shoulder, one piece. To me, this just is so, I don't know, kind of like dramatic and elegant. Love the soft, sagey olive green color. It is fully lined and padded. And I love this little detail that just kind of helps to accentuate the waist. That's continued all the way around the back. Once again, it's cut up high on the sides, which I love being somebody who doesn't have the world's longest legs. It helps to have garments that create the illusion of longer legs. Um, yeah, still have full bum coverage. Love this swimsuit. They have it in four different colors, green, orange, blue, and pink. I got it in green and pink. I'll put the pink on next, but I'm gonna have to go back for the other two. That's how much I like this. Okay, here it is in pink. Which you like better, the green or the pink? I like 
both. I am such a fan of a bright, bold color. This has all the same features that we're talking about. It's the exact same swimsuit, just in a different color. So rather than say that all again, I'll just tell you all one of my tips for creating content when you're traveling. Um, in Turks and Caicos, the water is blue and the sky is blue. And I knew I wanted to take a lot of photos on the beach featuring the absolutely gorgeous Grace Bay. With that in mind, I wanted my looks and my style to really work together with the environment to create standout images. So rather than choose a ton of blue swimsuits, I wanted to make sure I had some bold poppy colors that would separate me from the background. That's something I try and always think about because I do work as a content creator and, and um, that it's important to me. It might not be to you. You might just want to go on vacation and wear what you like and that's fine. We should all get to do exactly what we want to do in our free time and on our vacation. But if you're somebody who's looking for tips to make your Instagram photos pop, just keep that in mind. Pick something that's going to help separate you from the background unless you want to do something really cool and monochromatic. I just think something like this against blue, it really pops. Okay, one piece left in our haul and it's a fun little cover up essentially, so let's go put that on. All right fam, last but certainly not least, we have this two piece kind of, I guess Hawaiian shirt and short set. I saw this and it just felt fun to me. I'm so excited for summer. Winter was really difficult. I really missed the sunshine and the warmth and now anything that just reminds me of summer makes me so happy, including this set. So first I'll show you that this is a cinched waist, but it is a dummy drawstring. So you can't cinch it anymore, but it fits really true to size. So I don't think that you'll have to. It has two pockets. So if you're somebody who's looking for a nice functional cover up, a cover up with pockets is just amazing. You can put a room key, a chapstick, um, your cell phone in your pocket and I think that's a really hallmark of a great cover-up. And then it comes with this fun just kind of open oversized t-shirt. It's almost like a cardigan. It's like your boyfriend's Hawaiian t-shirt, right? Something about this was just so fun to me. It's really comfortable. It's light and silky and I just love it. I love it. I think it's like hilarious and cute. So that's everything. As always, I want to know what you liked best in the comments down below. But for now, let's go sign off and shout out a very special subscriber. And that is it for today's video. As always, thank you so much for taking the time to watch. It means more to me than I can say. A special thank you to my live chat crew who is here with me now, a live chat crew. I love you all so, so much. There's just a certain kind of core group of people who continue to come back um, no matter what the video is, no matter how long it's been. Uh, and that means more to me than I can say. You guys know who you are. I love you. Thank you so much. If you're looking for kindness, community, and friendship, please join us as we are always live chatting on my videos on Wednesdays and Sundays at 8 p.m. Central. And I also want to give a big subscriber shout out to Michael KJ. So Michael, you left a really sweet comment on one of my videos. You've watched some of the films that I've done and just left words that really meant a lot to me. So thank you for doing that. Thank you for caring and taking the time to watch videos and reach out and spread kindness. You really inspire me. You all inspire me. I love you so much and I can't wait to see you next time right here on Alleyways. Bye!